Good morning, everyone. Well, good news today as we move forward with a recovery for all of us. It's time to set a goal for a full reopening in New York City, and that goal is July 1st. We are ready to bring New York City back fully on July 1st. All systems go because you've earned it. We're going to keep working hard every day to make this city safer and safer. But what you have done, everyday New Yorkers, what you have done is the reason I can make this announcement today. Because you've gone out, you've gotten vaccinated, you've done so much to fight through this crisis. Now we can see that light at the end of the tunnel. What does it mean? It means we get to go back to so many of the things we love. It means so many jobs get to come back and soon. It means that the things that make New York City special will be clearer than ever this summer. This is going to be the summer of New York City. We're all going to get to enjoy this city again, and people are going to flock here from all over the country to be a part of this amazing moment in New York City. It means going to stores, and anyone who wants to shop at a store can go to a store again. It means bars and restaurants being able to come back, bring back so many of their employees, serve so many more customers. It means so many of our cultural events being open again, theaters coming back, so many of the things that we cherish. And what it means for everyday working people, for all those cooks and waiters and bartenders and folks who work in the kitchen for the small business owners, the folks who built up their businesses for years and years and have fought to survive. For everyday people, for our artists and our performers, it means a chance to do what you are so great at again and a chance to bring joy to so many other New Yorkers. So this is going to be an amazing summer. And I can't tell you, I just, I am so excited. I don't have words to say it enough. I am so excited that we'll be able to come back strong. Now, what do we have to do? We have to keep getting vaccinated. The reason I'm able to make this announcement today, and we have poured over the data, we have, as always, focused on the data and the science. And we now can set this goal because we've been moving forward constantly, more and more vaccinations, fewer and fewer infections, thank God. But we got to keep doing that, everyone. Everyone who hasn't yet been vaccinated, come forward now. This is the time. This is the right moment. It's easier than ever. It's simple. It's convenient. Let's keep moving with vaccinations. Let's keep being smart about all those basic, smart health care measures we've been taught by our health care heroes. We can do this July 1st. We all got a little bit of work to do, but we can get there together.